And here we have Barcelona against Galatasaray. I'm your commentator, John Champion, and summarising today is Jim Beglin. Hi, John. It's brilliant to be here with this fantastic atmosphere. I think we're in for a treat. Bartra. Going forward. Galatasaray have got possession back. Forward it goes. Laid in accurately. And he's made sure that's not getting through. Gustavo Lorenzetti. Juan. D'Alessandro. And now it's been played forward. Moving forwards. Stuani. Galatasaray have had the ball in promising areas but have nothing to show for it as yet. An interception. Stuani. And a much needed intervention that was too. Gustavo Lorenzetti. Galatasaray still without any attempts on target. Surely he can't miss from here. Carved away. That was certainly struck well enough. So here comes the corner. Up for the header. Galatasaray with a goal. They grab the opener. He offers such presence from set pieces. Well, look, it's it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header. And if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle. But that was beautifully met. It really was. So we resume at 1-0. Yeah, they may have got the lead, but that next goal now is absolutely crucial to the complexion of this one. Juan picks the ball up straight from a goal kick. Kedira. Tried to play it through. The space on the flank. Safe to say that wasn't the best of crosses. Well, for me, he had a very decent crack at it, but it has to be said that the odds on those from distance were never really that good, and you'd always favour the keeper in that instance. Alessandro Jackson Martinez he's bursting forward Gustavo Lorenzetti some dangerous moments but he was there to intervene looking to carve open the defence The keeper has claimed it. Nagatomo. Oh. 
Juan. D'Alessandro. I think they're building the play really nicely. If they can just find the right through ball, they could be in on goal. It's Ashley Young. Well intercepted. Saw the danger and got to it. Trouble looming, but he's able to cut it out. The danger was there, he dealt with it well. Stuani. D'Alessandro. Jackson Martinez. Five minutes to play in the first half. No, he's not getting through this time. Alessandro they get it forward Gustavo Lorenzetti Kedira no the defense alerts and picked out the danger and with that the referee brings the first half to a close well, you obviously have to give credit to the front men for the half-time lead, but I think the midfield can really pat themselves on the back too. They work tirelessly for me. Just the one goal separates them then. It's 1-0. Galatasaray getting us underway for this second half. Ashley Young. Ashley Young. A header. He shoots again. Puts it away. Two goals to the good, and they're set fair. Look, there just wasn't much of a gap to begin with, and to find it, I think. It was a fine drive, and I don't think the keeper could have really planned for that. I think he's a bit unlucky in that instance. So, it's now two without reply. Well, at 1-0, this game was very much in the balance, but at 2-0, they ought to be able to defend this lead from here. Montari plays it into the danger area. Position posing a few questions, but he's able to intercept. Gustavo Lorenzetti. Picked off there. Jackson Martinez. A long ball into space. And he hit the bar. Good pass through. There it is. They have a three-goal advantage, and that should be enough. How about that? A brace of goals for him now. We resume again, the score is 3-0. Galatasaray, still not utilising their bench. D'Alessandro. It's Jackson Martinez. Derrida. He could make something of this. Oh, yet another goal. They're clearly in no mood just to sit on their lead. That was a teasing finish. Well, although the keeper looked an imposing figure then, he remained totally unfazed and took the chance with great ease. They have this game in their hands now. He's looking to find his front men. Kedira. Stuani. D'Alessandro. Ashley Young. He's going on his own.
Galatasaray have a free kick for that. The opponents need to somehow keep them out here. Will he go direct here? D'Alessandro. So, how will they work this one? Hits it. And a goal. Jackson Martinez demonstrated great strength there. I mean, he really had to hold his man off and just create enough room for him to be able to get the shot away. And I think it's just top, top play. He's got two in this game. He's on a hat-trick. Surely they're well and truly out of sight now. Bursting forward. Bartra wins the battle and emerges with the ball. Forward it goes. An important interception. Things were starting to look dangerous. Ah, good interception. Just what they needed. Well played. That got them out of trouble. Stuani. He's done well on the right, but now needs some support. Gustavo Lorenzetti. Jackson Martinez, who we've just seen score that goal. And the through ball is intercepted. Stuani. Full time whistle within sight Stuani D'Alessandro Barcelona have the ball but they're not making much progress at the moment Getting it through there, he knew what was coming. Sends the ball over the defence. Stuani. Laid in accurately. The referee brings the game to a close. Their opponents must be feeling like they were hit by a tornado. They were ripped apart time and again by the movement and passing up front. I think some of the players are going to be a bit sore after that. There was so much passion and commitment out there. I can't remember anyone shirking a tackle. Many thanks to Jim alongside me. And that is finally it for the broadcast this afternoon.